Thank you. Hang with us for just a minute here. It has been an exciting day in St. Louis with the home opener, but it is a bittersweet one for us here at KMOV. Yeah, it certainly is. Today is Ray Preston's final day with us after 24 years right here at KMOV. And we wanted to celebrate Ray's career here during his last time on air. Take a look. When Don Rather got this letter from the folks at Levi's talking about his image, he wasn't quite sure what they were talking about. Maybe they didn't like the fact that the H is missing from the Rathert's name over the door. The breweries would have their own access to the caverns. It was usually started up at the brew house, and you came down some winding stairs like these. That's the latest from here down at uh, Clark and Tucker, where, again, the group looks like it might be on the move. Reporting live from downtown St. Louis, Ray Preston News 4. Check it out, guys. Revel in the moment. There's Alex Steen. And look at, look at the belt buckle, if you will, <laughs> that he's wearing. First thing, all right, there you go. He's lifting the cup. You're hearing cheers. That's from St. Louis City police officers. Yeah, I mean, we're so happy. It's, it's amazing. We're hearing Let's Go Blues, the chant right now from the crowd. What does it mean to you when you see, when you look out here and, oh my gosh, I'm, the crowd has grown even bigger since we got here. What does that mean to you when you see these fans gathered out here? Man, it's special, obviously. They, they, they're into it. And of course, you got to bring the noodle. And when you're driving to Atlanta, of course, you've got to show people that you are from St. Louis. A copy of the Post-Dispatch helps to let people know where we're from. As we take off from St. Louis, it's 11 degrees and the sun is just coming up. He's leaving, leaving. And I've got to say, Ray hasn't aged a bit. <laughs> Ray, I'll tell you what, on a personal level, working with you over the past 13 years, I've learned a lot. We are going to miss you here in the newsroom. It's not going to be the same without you. A native St. Louis son, Normandy High School, you've covered it all. We appreciate everything you've done here for the community over the last 24 years. Definitely a big loss for us here, Ray. You've done 24 years. Any final parting words, anything that really stuck out in your time here? Well, let me just say real quick, I have been just so lucky and fortunate to work with some of the most talented, creative, hardworking people in the news business industry, if you will. And for that, I just want to thank all my colleagues. I do want to thank everyone around St. Louis who has ever agreed to an interview, has granted me an interview, let me put a microphone in their face and answer my questions, and basically just let me tell their story. Born and raised in St. Louis, so I got Missouri blood flowing through my veins. I'm not going anywhere. This has been my work site St. Louis has for all these years, it's now going to be my playground. That's how I'm going to look at it. And so let me just say for one final time, reporting live, Ray Preston, News 4. A storied career, Ray. Thank it has you. been a joy. It has been a pleasure. Enjoy your playground. We're going to miss you at all those parades. He's mm -hmm. always at the